Holy crap. Holy crap. The hell was I doing? And it appears I have to get some new light bulbs. Son of a bitch. Great. Anyways, guys, I'm doing this as a, oh, I don't know what you could call it, <coughs> bitch video. Because no matter what I could do, I couldn't get this sucker to fire up. I don't know what it is. I just couldn't get it to fire. She wouldn't go. I kind of gave up onto it um, for a bit. There's gas in this tank. I uh, just took the old line and cut the good section out and connected it to the carb. I just connected it to the carb, as you can see there. And I did take the bowl off. The needle and seat appear to be okay. They appear to be fine. The floater was going up and down, no problem. The freaking throttle is just, it's completely dicked. It is like totally like fucking stuck. But I mean, you can crank this thing forever and just, just you can crank her forever and just... <laughs> crank it and crank it and crank it. She's a cranky whore. But no matter what you do, she won't fire. And it's got lots of spark. Lots of lots of spark. I checked my valves. Valves are good. So I'm not exactly too sure what this sucker is. <sighs> I don't know what the problem is. I know it's a well, it's a Tecumseh. It's a piece of shit. <laughs> Tecumseh's are garbage. It needed a, needed a Briggs from factory. Needed needed to put a Briggs and Stratton on her, and it would have been just fine. I don't got any motors here though, so I'm kind of kind of screwed there. So I don't know what exactly I'm gonna do. See, you see, there you go, Tecumseh. Son of a bitch. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. I was contemplating on uh, messaging a guy on YouTube by the name of Pepper Cat Keith, and he might know what the what a potential problem is. I don't know. He he knows a little bit more about the small engine type stuff than I do. I know the small engine and the and you know engine in a car they're all the exact same pretty well except for a bigger freaking motor. But you know what? Half the time I'm just lazy. and don't feel like thinking. <laughs> so I'm. I don't know, I'm, I'm out of ideas, I'm not exactly sure. Because yeah, I checked my valves, oh, I checked my valves there, and they were working just fine, you know, no issues, I had the bowl off, everything, it smelt a little funny, but everything in there was okay, blew everything out with the air, air hose, make sure the line was clear, and like, I, I don't know, I don't know, I just do not know, it doesn't make any sense, oh, son of a bitch. Doesn't make sense. I had to weld some plastic. That's why the, the torch is out over there. Torchy, torchy. Weld some plastic. The uh, gas tank here, there's a small leak underneath the rear. And, all right, well, grab the torch or heat her up, weld her together. <laughs> I don't know. So I'll, I'll send him this video as I edit it up. I'll edit it, render it, upload it, and then send it over to him. Trying to see if I can't find a freaking model number somewhere so I can maybe, you know, try and look this sucker up. But I can't even seem to find it. I was also thinking about maybe doing a restore on it. Get some new stickers and everything made up. Uh-oh, stickers. Shit, that's something for Bill's Team Max to do. So, you know, it's, it's going to be... I might use it this winter the way it is. And then, because, uh, see, I'll get, I'll get Billy. I'll get good old Billy. To redo that sticker for me because that actually is one big sticker but it's actually in two pieces it's supposed to be one big one but it's kind of in two pieces the rush kind of took over you know and i'll, I'll see if you'll redo the, the caution sticker for me here and the you know the made by arians manufacturing company and oh son of a bitch there's the model number right there what do you know Let's see if she'll will you focus no it ain't gonna focus you know, I'll get him to see if he'll redo some stickers for me. And the controls up here, you know, you got your reverse and... Oh, damn. That sucker is stiff. Holy crap. Reverse, neutral, first, second, third, fourth. The attachment here and caution here. So, God... Why is that so stiff? Wow, that is that is really stiff. 
I don't know what that's all about, but whatever. So I'll do this and message him and see what we can't do. It's got it's it's got to be something small, and I'm just overlooking it or something. I don't know. I'm just guessing carb kit, or fuck, maybe he's got a new carb, or a, a used good working carb down there. I don't know if there's a difference between the motors on the carbs, or if they're all the same, or what, but I am not exactly too sure. Uh, somewhere I'll have to find it. I know there's a number here somewhere on the motor. Knowing my luck, it's underneath the starter here, but ah well. I'll figure it out and we'll make something out of this. I need to get it working so I can use her this winter. Oh, tire change, yeah. Sucker came equipped with tire change. So, anyways, guys, uh, keep chooching.